Hi, book lovers. Welcome to My Reading Journey, an online diary of the books the Information Services Librarians at Lincolnwood Public Library are reading. I'm Paula, and this week I'm reading a graphic novel, a genre patrons may not realize is available through the library's Overdrive and Libby apps. This week I read the graphic novel, The Best We Could Do by T. Bui, the story of one family's survival during years of upheaval in Vietnam and their eventual immigration to the United States. The library also has a copy of this book in print in its graphic novel collection. A visual memoir, The Best We Could Do explores the hardships, uncertainty, and emotional turmoil individuals experience during the immigration process and the impact cultural displacement has on children and their families. Tibui shares her family's daring escape after this fall of South Vietnam in the 1970s, leaving their home country with almost nothing. Ms. Bui offers readers insight into her parents' teenage years and early marriage, and how lengthy periods of social and economic upheaval and violence prior to their leaving Vietnam shaped their decisions, their relationship, and their life in the United States. As the book begins, Miss Bui is becoming a mother herself and begins to understand what it means to be a parent and why her own parents decided to leave everything behind. The Best We Could Do won a 2017 American Book Award and is T. Bui's debut graphic novel. As she shared in an interview with NPR, Books like Art Spiegelman's Mouse about the Holocaust and Marjane Satrapi's Persepolis about growing up during Iran's Islamic Revolution inspired her to weave the personal and the political and the historical to tell a story of the Vietnam War and all the things that caused it in a way that she felt she hadn't seen before. As her interview with NPR notes, Readers will learn details about her parents' lives, like the executions of political prisoners her father witnessed, how much money her mother got for selling her valuables, and the dimensions of the boat her family took to flee Vietnam. Ms. Bui started working on The Best We Could Do in 2002 as a graduate student in an attempt to understand why her parents chose to leave Vietnam and start over in the United States. Originally a compilation of family history transcripts with photographs, Ms. Bui realized the story would be better told as a graphic novel. She had to learn how to draw comics and finished a first draft in 2005. In the ensuing seven years, she became a mother, moved from New York to California, and was a founding teacher of the Oakland International High School, the first public high school in California for recent immigrants and English learners. Today, she teaches in the Master of Fine Arts Comics program at the California College of the Arts. The Best We Could Do is a beautifully illustrated graphic novel for adults, but will also appeal to middle and high school aged readers interested in how world events can impact individuals. And it does have a happy ending. I hope you will consider putting The Best We Could Do by T. Bui on hold in Overdrive or Libby today or request the print copy through the library's catalog. Until my next book, I'll see you next time.